Hi, everyone. I'm State Senator Robert Jackson, and this is Represent NYC on Manhattan Neighborhood Network. And our guest today on Represent NYC is Reverend Dr. Dagmaris, who is the pastor of the Fort Collegiate Church on 181st Street and Fort Washington Avenue. She also is a constituent of ours in the 31st Senatorial District mm -hmm. and Richard Fife, commonly, commonly known as Richie Fife. And Richie Fife is a consultant. Let, let me talk about New York State. Uh, obviously, you know, we have a majority in the New York State Senate right now. We have 40. And our goal was to try to reach the uh, super majority of at least 42, realistically 44, 45. But you and I know that we have heard over the past couple of weeks uh, that people like Ron Lauder has pumped cut several millions of dollars and others are wealthy uh, New Yorkers or people in order to try to uh, turn and flip, especially Long Island, about five seats that uh, were won uh, two years ago to give a Democratic majority, trying to flip it back to Republican and upstate also. So my understanding, there's about 36 uh, Democrats that are definitely coming back and there's eight seats which are flippable. And so we're hoping to get back to 40 and 42. Can you express your opinion about that if you have as far as pumping in millions of dollars into these local Senate races? And then I'll turn to you, De uh, Dr. Whitaker. Richie. I mean, obviously, when you have one side that puts in five, seven million dollars or whatever the number ended up being it, into these local races in small districts, it has an influence on it. Uh, I think as we wait for the absentee ballots to be put, uh, counted next week, uh, hopefully some of them kind of come back and then, uh, then forge ahead and, and move forward on the issues that are important to people. Now, Dr. Whitaker, what about... Uh, uh, people pumping in millions of dollars into a local Senate race. Now, obviously, you've heard that and uh, uh, OAC that they pumped in so much money uh, to try to defeat her to knock her out of the Congress. Uh, and in fact, uh, most people knew that was not going to happen. But they mm -hmm. pumped in so much money into that race, and 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 like Richie said, millions of dollars in local Senate races. So, what's your opinion about that? And you get this comment. So what I have to say about that is, is that I wish we changed our business model of yeah. elections. I wish that we pump millions of dollars into our community so that people can have opportunities for economic development, for affordable housing, for a sustainable, affordable, and accessible health care, for education where our children do not have to be wondering where the, the money is going to come for them to buy a book or to have access to quality education. If we pump the same kind of money in serving the people, we will get the votes. Mm -hmm.